Okay, welcome back to another video of the Bootstrap Development Course. So, in the last video we created our cards with our scorches. And in this video we're actually gonna build the amazing content. So that means that we're gonna build the content uh, row and we're gonna add three invisible cards with unordered lists on them. And the unordered lists are gonna contain some of the courses, some of the projects, and some of the stuff that we are gonna do with DevScorch 3. And this is going to be really interesting and we're going to do this in probably two videos. So, first thing we're going to do, we're going to um, check where the row ends. That's going to be the card row that is here. And under there we're going to create a new row. And we're going to call this div class of row. That is on line 139. And we're going to give this a second class with list row. Because here we're going to store all the lists that we are, um, no, we need two rows exactly, because first we're gonna create an amazing content. So I think we're gonna call this amazing row instead of list row. And inside there, we're gonna start writing a column 12. So I think you already know how that works. So div class of call-sn-12, call-nd-12, call dash LG-12 and Cole-XL-12. I'm sure that one of you guys are, is so good with uh, with mixing music, you probably can make a rap, a rap video out of it. Okay, so in here, we're gonna call div class and we're gonna call this amazing-content. Close it. And in here, we're gonna do an H3 of class. Let me check if it has to be white. Yes, it has to be white. Do we have... So we're gonna give this, probably. No, 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 we're gonna write a separate uh, class for this. We're gonna call this amazing-h3. I'm gonna give this amazing content, exclamation mark. And under the scorch h5, we're gonna do dot amazing-row. And under amazing row, we're gonna do dot amazing, oh, Dot, dot amazing oh my god content and under amazing content we're gonna call dot amazing dash h3 we're gonna give this a color of white and we're gonna give the amazing content a margin right of auto we're gonna give this a margin dash left of auto and we're going to give this a text align of center. And theoretically, all the, all the information inside the H3 is going to be centered. Under here, we're going to call mm, probably a P of class. And in this case, we can call the scorch P because it's going to be the same color, I think. Let's check. One BB and also one BB probably. Okay, so we're not gonna call the scorch, but we're gonna call yeah the scorch P. Okay, fine. Scorch dash P. And the text for this one is gonna be some of our courses and projects. So some of our courses and projects. With Dashcourts, we're actually gonna build real life uh, or real time uh, applications like Facebook clones, Instagram clones, 9gag, and stuff like that. So it's gonna be pretty amazing. So we're gonna save both files. And let's see how this looks on the website. Yeah, as you can see now, here we have the amazing content part. And what we're gonna do here, we're gonna change this to an H4 maybe probably and I think let's check the design is it bold yes it is so we're gonna make it bold back here and inside the amazing h3 we're gonna give this uh, font weight of bold and we're gonna change h3 in index.css to h4 in index.html h4 and we're gonna change in the everything to h4 here Save it. Let's check it again. Oh. 
I probably forgot to save both files. Okay, that's better. And now we're gonna give this uh, some extra spacing. So for that we did the amazing row and we're gonna give this some uh, margin dash top of maybe 100 pixels. Let's see how high this is. Mm, yeah, this looks nice. And under there we're gonna create some cards. And we're gonna need three cards. So after the um, row, so gonna close this. After the row, we're gonna create another row, so div class. And we're gonna call this actually the list. Oh, we're gonna, first, we're gonna call row. And after the row, we're gonna give a separate class of list dash row. Open it up. And we're gonna need three, uh, three containers or three columns. So we're gonna call call dash four. So call of um, div class call dash sm dash 12, call dash nd dash four, call dash lg dash four, call dash xl dash four. Okay, and we can copy this one four times, three times, so one and two. So we have three columns of four. And we're gonna open all of those up. Then we go back to Bootstrap. So we go to the Bootstrap website and we copy this card again. So copy it. And we're gonna save it in one. And in that one, this one we're gonna finish it and after that we're gonna paste it in. So we click on the div class of card and we're gonna give this an extra class. And we're gonna subclass this with probably list card. Perfect. And under imaging h4, we're gonna call dot list row and on the list row we're gonna call dot list oh dot list card <laughs> okay pretty cool and we're gonna give the card I'm so sorry um, for this cut and I had to cut it because um, the storage of my camera was full so we go to list card and we're gonna call margin left and we're gonna give this an auto we're gonna give this a margin dash right of auto. And we're gonna give this a background color of transparent. Okay. We're gonna give this a width of, let's see, on the design how, what the width is gonna be. Let's give the width of 270. 270 pixels and let's give this a height of let's check it out of 190 okay so and inside the card we're gonna create a ul so we're gonna create ul of class and we're gonna call um, content list and on the list card, we're gonna call dot content list. Okay, so here we actually finished. Um, we actually finished the template for this. In the next video, we're gonna add uh, the unordered lists with the with the with the with the leaves on it, and then we're gonna beautify the cards. So I hope you learned something in this video. I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope to see you in the next video.